As training hots up in the mid-June sun, here are the latest reports. Ozeki Shodai vows to regain the 12 kilos he's apparently lost since taking the title in 2020. I want to weigh more than 165, he said, claiming he'd have more noodles delivered to achieve the goal. But I can't just pile on pounds, he added. I need more practice bouts too. Tuesday 15th saw his stable welcome outsiders for the first time since early 2020, allowing him to fight the likes of Nishikigi and come off 6-5. When you've been practicing with the same guys for two years, you certainly feel the benefits of facing different styles, Shodai said. Asked about his 10 May defeats, he replied, I just couldn't get into my groove at all and therefore couldn't rouse myself. My hips just weren't getting into that first charge. To rectify things, I'm working on a faster attack post-charge, and on preventing my foe from securing his stance. He fought Nishikigi 13 more times on Wednesday, with no score given. The hub of training activity now seems to be Sadagatake stable which hosted Takayasu on Wednesday for a marathon session. Kotonowaga, for example, took him on 18 times straight, and came off worse. Waka's total score, including bouts against stablemates, was 8-14. Takayasu finished 17-10. It's the first time Takayasu and I have trained so intensively, said Waka who of course held him for a minute in Osaka. It was a real quality session, he continued. Takayasu, meanwhile, declared, I won't lose to younger men for stamina. I want to pump my body up into prime condition for July. Let's just pray that unlike last year, he won't overdo the final session. Takayasu was back at Sadogatake on Thursday, and joined by Otake Stables Oho and Takekuma Stables Gonoyama for a Saitama Sakai reunion, Kotonowaka and Kotoshoho, the other senior members. He beat Gonoyama five times straight, then watched him go three and three with Kotoshoho. I really felt the difference in power, Gonoyama said ahead of his Division 2 bow. Everything about these guys is a different level, he added. Kotoshoho, meanwhile, felt he could work on his moves post Tachiai, which he's recently deemed below par. It's not about strength of grip, but position. Me underneath, burrowing deep into my foe's defenses, he explained. Kotonowaka believes he's been studied more, and thus blocked from fighting his way of late saying, I have to deal with their wrecking tactics properly. And Oho, by far the top dog in his stable, said it was the first time in ages that he'd lost more practice bouts than he'd won. Takayasu in particular is so difficult to shift, he noted. For myself, I've been getting closer to the action, observing a session at the new Hanaregoma stable this morning. No pictures, I'm afraid. It's all about gaining their trust, for now. The more they trust, the more we can do. But I would call my first ever chats with Shimazu Umi and Ichi Yamamoto a minor success.